Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. All right, next matchup on the Crown Jewel pay per view was Zelina Vega versus Dewdrop in the Queen's Crown Tournament Finals. Now, before I get into this match, which I ain't gonna lie to you, it's not much to get into, <laughs> but let me let me talk about this tournament. Cause I meant to talk. I meant to talk about this tournament and the King of the Ring tournament. I meant to talk about both, probably in the same video. But here's here's the thing about this tournament. They made this Queen's Crown seem so useless, and that's what bothers me. That's what bothers me a lot because the women. Because the women in WWE deserve so much more. I thought we were on a very good path when we finally made the first ever women's Royal Rumble, right? No, let me start. Let me let me go a little further back. Back in 2015, when Sasha, Becky, and Charlotte all made their way to the main roster, I thought we were on a good path of seeing good things for women and at the time we kind of were we kind of were you know that was more of a foreshadow for what things to happen because three years later we got the very first women's royal rumble and then we got the first ever i believe we got actually the same year we got the first ever women's elimination chamber and i believe the same exact year we got the first ever women's money in the bank. So that whole 2018 year was dedicated to better women's wrestling. Cool. You know, I was cool with it. I was fine with it. They deserve they deserve better, right? We deserve better from these women because a lot of these women are very talented. So we deserve better. Cool. I was fine with that. Then we progressed even more with, what else we progressed with? Um, we progressed with the first ever WWE Women's Tag Team Titles. In a sense, that was a little bit eh, because there's there wasn't that many women's tag teams then, and now there's pretty much none now. So, so, so it is, you know, it it is what it is, you know. <laughs> Um, let's see. Now we were granted our first ever pretty much queen of the ring, right? We were pretty much given that. And that was cool. I was like, all right, we can make something out of this. The women that were in this match, in this tournament were iffy, but... A lot of them could have benefited from it. Liv Morgan could have benefited from it. Tony Storm could have benefited from it. Shayna Baszler could have benefited from it. Sheesh. I think Zelina Vega could probably benefit from it, right? Just those four alone could have benefited from it. You know what we got in this tournament? We got each match, two minutes. Each match, either two minutes, a minute and a half, less than three minutes. That's literally what we got each match. And that sucks a lot. It sucks a lot. So, heading into this match, honestly, I think we all knew Zelina Vega was going to win. We, I just needed to know how she was going to win. Just how. Like, because Dewdrop is... See, I'm not going to say she's a big one, because that's disrespectful. I'm not going to say that. But Dewdrop is... um. A bit taller in stature, <laughs> we'll say that, than Zelina Vega. So how was Zelina Vega going to win this match? Distraction? The most devastating move in all of sports entertainment? The surprise roll-up? How was she going to win? Well, she won with the cold red. Okay. One, two, three. She wins. Not much to really talk about this match because, again, it was three minutes. Or less than three minutes. It was pretty much uh, 
Zelina ducking and dodging. Then when she got caught, she got hit. She got slammed. All that type of ish, right? Just, just simplistic as that, right? Um, yeah. <laughs> that's, pre that's, pre that's pretty much what it is. You know what I'm saying? Um, Zelina Vega is now queen, I guess, queen of the ring. Congratulations to her. I'm pretty sure she can pull this gimmick off. Because I'm pretty sure she's about to be the, one of the most annoying people in WWE. Um, I'm hoping it goes somewhere. Will it? Only time will tell. I ain't going to I ain't gonna put the cart before the horse. I ain't going to sit here and go, this ain't going to work. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I'm down for it. I'm down to see what's up. So we'll see as time goes on. Uh... And that's all I got. <laughs> that's all I got with that match. All right. Next match. Let's get it.